One of the worst types of dog aggression problems is that of dog aggression directed at people. An aggressive dog can cause some very painful and serious injuries, especially if the victim is a child. If you have a dog that is showing signs of aggression towards people, it is urgent for you to correct your dog's problem. It is not unusual for a dog known for biting to be put to sleep by the authorities. There are some obvious signs you can look for to spot an aggressive dog and avoid the possibility of a biting incident. A dog that is acting aggressively will display that aggression by barking loudly, snarling and growling, showing his teeth, and maybe even snapping them. He will have an intense stare and the hair on his back will be raised. He may also try to jump up or lunge at the object of his aggression. You can tell by the intensity of the aggression just how imminent a biting episode might be. If you are seeing signs like this with your dog, you definitely will want to learn how to correct this problem before he bites somebody. Aggression often comes as a result of conditioning, quite often through repeated exposure to something abusive perhaps another dog or a human, and by countering that bad conditioning with a positive experience that is repeated frequently over time, you should be able to correct your dog's aggression problem and return him to a well-balanced happy state of being. If your dog is aggressive, the first steps you should take to prevent serious problems would include keeping your dog in an enclosed area, or in the case of no fence, he should be put on a restraint. You cannot take the chance of an aggressive dog running loose. He will be a certain danger to any passersby he encounters while running around. In order to correct your dog's aggression towards people, you should arrange to meet with a friend your dog already knows, or at least doesn't already have a problem with, for a visit. Often, dogs are more aggressive in their own territory, so you might even want to begin this training at a neutral location, where your dog will feel less protective and hopefully less aggressive. Wherever you decide to start the training, first put your aggressive dog on a leash, and in the case of biters, it might even be necessary to use a muzzle as a further precaution. Please visit our website at getfreedogtraining.com for more details. If this is your first time on the channel and you haven't subscribed yet, Click that subscribe button. Thanks for watching, and we'll see you next time.